Western blotting is a vital technique in gene cloning used to verify the expression, integrity, and functionality of proteins produced by cloned genes. It plays a critical role in ensuring that the cloning process results in the correct protein product. One of the most important uses of Western blotting is to confirm protein expression. After a gene is cloned and expressed in a host system, researchers can use antibodies to detect whether the protein encoded by the gene is actually produced. This step verifies that the clone gene is expressed not just at the mRNA level, but also as a functional protein. Western blotting also helps confirm the size and integrity of the expressed protein. By determining its molecular weight, researchers ensure the protein matches the expected size, ruling out issues like improper splicing or degradation. Additionally, post-translational modifications such as phosphorylation or glycosylation, which affect protein functionality, can be detected by shifts in the protein's molecular weight. Another key function of Western blotting is to verify protein functionality. By using antibodies specific to certain modifications, researchers can check if the clone protein has undergone critical post-translational modifications necessary for its biological activity. In gene cloning, tagging proteins with markers like his tags or flag tags makes it easier to detect and purify them. Western blotting confirms the presence of these tagged proteins, ensuring that purification procedures successfully isolate the desired protein. Western blotting also plays a major role in validating mutant proteins. When cloning genes with mutations, researchers can use this technique to compare the expression levels and molecular integrity of mutant proteins to the wild type. For low-abundance proteins, Western blotting offers high sensitivity, allowing researchers to detect even small amounts of protein and optimize cloning strategies for better yield. It's also essential in studies of protein-protein interactions, such as co-immunoprecipitation, helping verify that cloned proteins interact with their partners. Finally, Western blotting is a powerful tool for troubleshooting cloning experiments. If the expected protein isn't detected or shows abnormal size, it could indicate problems like incorrect plasmid construction or post-translational degradation, guiding researchers to adjust expression systems or vector design. In conclusion, Western blotting is indispensable in gene cloning. It provides essential information about protein expression, size, modifications, and functionality, ensuring the success of cloning experiments and aiding in troubleshooting issues that may arise.